make ends meet. It's a challenge for a lot of people these days. So in this morning's Don't Waste Your Money report, we're helping you cut your monthly costs. Yeah, who doesn't want to cut the cost? And as yeah. Consumer Reporter Joanne Purton shows us, it's sometimes as easy as picking up the phone. If you're getting up and planning your day right now, be sure to budget in a half hour or so to make some phone calls. They can truly pay off. Are your monthly bills getting you down? Credit cards, phone, cable, insurance. It leaves Christine Songen shaking her head. Never. Out of control. Really? Yeah. It's mm -hmm. ridiculous. But the good news is you can reduce some of those bills with five easy calls that can save you money. I was just calling because I wanted to see if there was anything I could possibly do to reduce my overall like monthly bill. Andrea Deckard is a coupon blogger who offers other moms money-saving tips at the savingslifestyle.com. But on this day, she decided to help herself. Um, the entire bill that we pay to the cable company is um, $150. Andrea decided it was time to take action. She noticed right away she was paying for services she never used. Do I really need to have a cell phone and a home phone? Is there something else I can do to save more money to help us, you know, with our monthly budget? So she called the cable company and started to negotiate. The cost of high-speed data is within this package is thirty-four sixty-three. Okay. Andrea says that's the first call you should make. Find what cheaper packages they may have. Andrea says then call your landline phone company if you've got one. Do you really need call waiting anymore? Three, call your cell phone provider. If you're not using all your minutes or your texts, consider reducing the amount you pay for. Four, your insurance agent. Make sure your home and cars are bundled and consider boosting your deductible to lower your rates. And finally, call your credit card provider and say you may drop the card if they can't offer you a lower rate. I think if you call them and just say, hey, here's the situation, here's what I have right now, tell me exactly um, what kind of plans are available. Let me tell you exactly what I need. Andrea is working on all of those for her family. With just one call, she was able to cut her $147 a month cable bill to $102 by eliminating features she just didn't need. Bottom line, decide what little things you're willing to give up because they could add up to some big savings. Be sure to be polite and don't be afraid to negotiate a bit. They can only say no. I'm Joanne Purton, 7 Action News.